Hello everyone. Welcome back to BTNX Learning. Today, let's see a demo on how to use Lambda functions in Excel with the help of ChatGPT. Okay, we will be using ChatGPT in our day-to-day -day operations. Even if we encounter any issues, if you are not sure what to proceed next, we can use the same issues or error in ChatGPT. It will guide us as how to proceed for the next step. Okay, so let's go to ChatGPT. If you are someone using Excel in your day-to-day -day job, let me tell you something, you are going to be replaced unless you are integrating AI in your Excel. If you integrate AI in your Excel workflow, let me tell you something, you are going to be 10x more productive and you, you will be getting that promotion that you deserve. If you want to learn all this, join me for my 2 hours workshop on Excel using AI. Okay, so I am going to give this prompt. Okay, this will be the thing. Create a basic lambda function. Okay, so like uh, for example, if I give the value two plus three, it should give uh, into four. It should give me the result. Okay, we'll see a basic example. You will come to know. Okay, what is a lambda like that? You will come to know with the example. Create a basic lambda function. Excel that add numbers and then multiplies the sum by a third number. I'll explain to you. With an example. Okay, better we'll make it everything three. It should not prompt it again. So we'll see it. Did, okay, that's giving the prompt. It's giving okay. Okay. So, for example, if you want to, okay, with the, this is the, with the example I will tell you, 2 plus 3, 5, 5 into 4 are 20, okay. So, imagine like this type of operations we may need to use in different places, okay. So, we, we have a functions like this, we, we are supposed to define a function and we need to give different values, okay. Function is, means what? It will be called in different places with the different values. Okay, it the next time when you are calling it may it need not to be of two plus three plus four, it can be nine plus nine plus five, but it should give the exact result. And we need not to execute the same uh, formula again and again, right? It has to we need to reduce it. Okay, for example, okay, this same part, this lambda thing, I am taking to Excel. For example, I'm giving okay, I am giving over here. So 20. Okay. The same thing, if I give 5 over here, what it is adding? 2 plus 3, 5. 5 into 4, 20. If I give over here, it should be 32. Okay. So, but we need to do in a different way. Okay. So, one before we execute, guys, one important update. Okay. As you all aware that A is taking over the world. In such a short span of time, we have seen so many layoffs, millions of jobs replaced by AI. And you don't want to get affected by this recession wave. So A won't replace you, but the person using A will replace your job. So if you want to save your job and become irreplaceable in your career, join our three hours AA tools workshop in which we'll teach you about the best AA tools to upskill, increase your productivity and enhance your career. All the installation steps and other AA tools will be explained detail in our B10X program. So make your future secure with us. Join our workshop by clicking the link below in the description. Okay. So this will be our link. Okay, b10x.in. Okay, if you go over here, b10x.in. And here you can see all the upcoming workshops like AA Tools Workshop, Office Using AA Workshop, those things. Here, if you register here, it will ask what are what will be the next details. Okay. Like then what when will be the next workshop? 
okay and why to join this course and what you will learn from this workshop so don't miss it guys okay definitely it will help you okay now let's go back to our coding part okay so we have seen in this example it's 32 we cannot do in each and every places right about this okay and before that i will explain from here what is written define the lambda function okay and uh, let's ask what is lambda okay if you are if you want to know okay powerful relatively new feature that allows you to create custom reusable function okay that means we can use it anywhere that is called custom okay instead of a excel inbuilt function it is a custom function okay you we'll see without having to write them in vba earlier time we used to keep vba for that also there are some uh, demo hours we have given and we need not to write them in vba a lambda function lets you define a formula that can be used like any other built-in function okay this is the keyword okay it is we are for defining a function that function can be used in anywhere else and these are the uh, advantages like customization reusability no vba record okay so these are the part because just i want to make you understand what is a lambda okay so here it is define the lambda function first we need to define the lambda function open excel go to cells anywhere you want to define the lambda function will be given in three parameters okay uh, which will be the sum okay so a comma b comma c it is given okay so and then it is giving uh, the, the these formulas defines a lambda function that takes t three argument okay a comma b comma c like earlier we have given here right uh, five comma three comma four we have given right like that okay so it is given okay so what I am doing here I am taking this I am copying the code I am keeping in some other cell okay instead of better I will delete it here so that you should not get confused I am giving here okay okay this is the lambda function okay if i execute here it will ask the reference because we have I, I have not given the value let's hold it okay name the function okay and uh, you can optionally name the function for reuse uh, to do this go to the formula step okay so he's telling us go to the formulas here is the formula step okay i'm deleting it just for understanding purpose go to the formula step and go to the click the name manager and then give new give your function example add multiply some name okay we can give paste the lambda function formula in the refers to box okay we'll see okay so i am co copying this code okay i am going over here as per they suggested i am going to name manager i am giving new over here okay i'm giving add add multiply okay this is the name so when wherever i'm using this if i want to do this uh, calculation i can refer this okay i will explain you okay and here i'm giving the formula whatever i have cal calculated okay you can use any name over here okay. so this will point over here okay close okay so now it has and next what it is telling use the function now you can use this lambda function like any other function cell for example if you name it add multiply you can use it in the cell uh, what they're telling means if i'm going over here okay equal to see now when i give add ad means it is showing this add multiply that means this is the lambda function like name add multiply we have given okay i'm giving this tab so that will come i am giving two comma two comma so the value has come right what it has to come okay similarly it will be like 3 plus 2 is equal to 5 5 into 2 10 okay if i want to get this uh, same uh, function in somewhere else with the different uh, values i will give here is equal to add same add multiply if you give tab it will come out here 7 comma 7 comma 7 okay 98 okay so this is the advantage of this lambda function guys so imagine in your case example you need to encounter this type of activities it need not to be the same formula okay you can use any other formula 
you can give a big formulas also this will fun, uh, execute it okay so this is the way to use the lambda function any help you can use chat gpt for your reference okay so i hope you enjoyed this session guys see you again bye bye take care